What's up, everybody? Welcome to my Instagram Live. Today, I am in an awesome mood. Why? Because last night at the Hell in a Cell pay-per-view, it was The Miz and Maurice versus Daniel Bryan and Brie Bella. And in that match, my wife and myself were victorious. And as much as Daniel Bryan and Brie Bella can call us cowards, we weren't cowards. We didn't cheat. Maurice rolled Brie Bella up and pinned her one, two, three, proving that she is superior to Brie Bella. That's right, Maurice is superior to Brie Bella. The Miz is superior to Daniel Bryan. And as a team, Miz and Mrs., Miz and Maurice, are superior to Daniel Bryan and Brie Bella. There is no argument. As much as people can talk on Instagram and Twitter and all your little social media, you can write blogs all about it, but the blog better say that The Miz and Maurice beat Daniel Bryan and Brie Bella. And that's not the end of it. Because let's face it, at the Super Showdown, it is The Miz versus Daniel Bryan. Whoever wins will have an opportunity at the WWE Champion, AJ Styles. This is where I should have been a long time ago, on top of the card, on all the posters. My merchandise should be front and center at every venue, at every arena. Because I am the biggest star that SmackDown Live has. When I talk, people listen. And I can make the WWE Championship and turn it into a main event caliber title. So at Super Showdown, I will get my opportunity at the WWE Championship after I beat Daniel Bryan again, just like I did at SummerSlam. Now a lot of people have been talking about SmackDown Live tomorrow in Tulsa, Oklahoma. Well, you should be talking because tomorrow I have a surprise guest on Ms. TV. And right now, I'm going to give you a huge announcement. Are you ready for it? Let me get ready. That announcement is... You're going to have to wait till tomorrow to see who is on SmackDown Live on Ms. TV. But I promise you, it will be awesome because everything I do is awesome. Everything I do is must-see. And I promise you, it's going to be a guest that you are never, you're not going to want to forget. I don't even know why I said never, but you're never going to want to forget it. You're not going to want to forget it because the fact is, you're not going to want to miss it. Tonight, the Emmys are going on. Ms. and Mrs. are ineligible because our show debuted after the cutoff line. So, this is my formal announcement. For your consideration, Ms. and Mrs. Best Unscripted Reality Show. Next year, I should be having a speech on the podium thanking everyone that participated on Ms. and Mrs. after we win the Emmy. I'm excited, are you? Should we not? Ms. and Mrs. made you laugh. It made you cry. It made you feel warm. It made you feel amazing. How could it not win an Emmy? I'm excited. I'm ready. I mean, just watching these Emmys gets me excited about next year's Emmys. <laughs> and last but not least, let's talk about fantasy football. Let's talk about FanDuel. Because on FanDuel.com backslash The Miz, it's where you could actually go in. The Miz versus Johnny Bananas. My team versus his team. And this week, once again, two for two, I beat Johnny Bananas. That is right, 135 to 119. To be completely honest with you, it was a terrible team. My team did not do as well as I hoped it would do, but I still ended up winning. So what does that mean? The top 10 from my team, they get to go to the finals in week five free free they are free in the finals where they can win thousands in cash and prizes now are these this this top 10 are they all pros no no one's really a pro no one really knows anything about fantasy football everyone will say they know everything and you could sub think about it and be like oh this could happen but you never know in football nobody thought that Vontae Davis was going to retire at halftime 
Nobody thought that Josh Gordon would be going to the New England Patriots. No one would have thought that Corey Coleman would have got cut from the Patriots to make room for Josh Gordon. None of these things, you never know what's going to happen in fantasy football. So this week, week three, you have an opportunity to win thousands in cash and prizes, whether you are a fantasy guru or you are a fantasy rookie. You could still win in this game. Go to fanduel.com backslash the Miz and pick your team. The way this works for anyone that has no idea but might be thinking about being on Team Miz or hell, be on Team Bananas. Go against me. You won't win. I'm the winner. The way it works is you get a lo- uh, an allotted amount of money. And you need to pick quarterbacks, running backs, wide receivers, tight ends, and you need to pick a defense. And you need to allot that money in all those positions. Whoever gets the best team, gets the most points, whatever players do the best, you will be able, if you're in the top 10, you will be able to go to the finals where you could have a free entry. By the way, you can win, if you're top 10, you win money that week as well. So, go to fanduel.com backslash the Miz, be on my team, play with me, play against me. Either way, playing against the Miz, playing with the Miz, that's an opportunity of a lifetime. Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to thank you all for tuning in to my Instagram Live. I think we covered a lot today. We covered WWE, Miz TV, Super Showdown. I mean, I covered a lot. Fantasy football at the Emmys. We covered it all, people. Covered it all. So, thank you very much. We'll see you tomorrow on SmackDown Live, where we have a special guest for Miz TV. And it will be 